17 single-engine light airplanes made their landing into Israel, carrying 46 French pilots and crew members who arrived to support the Israeli people and tour the country. In a gesture, some would say, counters pro-Palestinian flight tail activities. This initiative is, in fact, coming from France, a group of French private pilots, all uh, small aircrafts. They wanted to come here in Israel, and they will support the people of Israel. None of them uh, are Jewish, Jewish people, so they will be here. And for me, it's very important to bring people uh, and then to show them the real aspects, the real facets of the, the state of Israel. We're here to promote friendship between France, Europe, and the people of Israel. And that's why we chose to come here. We just landed now. A great arrival, and I always wanted to come, and this was the perfect opportunity to come. So yeah, we came here the slow way. It's a long way to, to come with this plane, and uh, because this plane don't uh, go very quickly, but uh, it's an interesting uh, travel. It's uh, very rare, I suppose, that uh, light flight, light planes like this coming to see you. And uh, I expect that more and more people will uh, appreciate to, to come uh, with, like uh, we do today. This group of pilots will tour Israel for a few days, visit the holy sites, and end their trip with a special flight to Masada, one of Israel's historical sites and the lowest airfield on Earth. We took care of a special permission to fly within <clears throat> Israel from Haifa to Masada. Masada is a very attractive point of landing for pilots when the altimeter is working the opposite way. It's something uh, the only pilot will understand. Oh, we're looking forward to do visiting all the, the major, major sites. So we're going to be visiting uh, Jerusalem, Tel Aviv. Uh, we're going to be visiting all the uh, major attractions over the next three days and uh, learning as much as we can in the next three days. The initiative was welcomed by both Israeli and French officials who felt it may assist in changing Israel's image around the world. For me, I, I think it's like an answer to the flotilla. We, we had the flotilla for Gaza, you know, who, who, who was really, who, who causes damage to the image of the state of Israel. And now I call that the squadron to Haifa. So people are coming to visit the country, to see, to, to, to see the Christian sites also, but also to support uh, the people of Israel. I think it's, it's really a great initiative because uh, it's a link between people. It's not, you know, we, we, help, we help to, I hope we help a little bit, but it's an initiative between people. You don't change things like that in once, you know, whatever we, we influence, good or bad, it's a stone in the wall we want to build, you know, or the bridge we want to build. This marks the first time in history that Israel hosts such a large aircraft rally, hosted by Israel's Aircraft Owners and Pilots Association. For JN1, I'm Sivan Raviv, Haifa, Israel.